That's right. That's right. This is as good as it gets. This knowledge that you're getting is as good as it gets. Yep. This is what you should be paying $45,000 a year for. This is what you should be putting it putting it all on the line for. Yep. That's right. Hey, remember we, were, we did that sit down a while back? We read that quote, I think it was by Roosevelt. A, 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 a thorough knowledge of the Bible is more valuable than a college education. That's right. Now this is from one of the so-called founding forefathers of this country. So for somebody to say that, you people to claim to be so American, you might want to take some kind of heed in that. That's right. All right? Because the, the Bible is full of history, full of knowledge, full of just top shelf understanding, like the brother said. It ain't going to get no better than that. Practical ways to live. Practical ways to live, because that's what you're struggling with right now. Living. Yes, exactly. What it is. Living. That's right. all you want to do is live. Yep, that's it. So you were taught that you had to have the brand new car. You were taught that you, the, everything that you have has to be up to date. Right. But what you don't know is it's just a trick. The 2014 Camaro, that car was made up 10 years ago. Yep. It's just a succession of cars, and they just go, yeah, as soon as I said, he took off. <laughs> it's just the same thing with the phones and all that. These yeah. phones, the models have been out for the longest. Yeah. But they just sucking your money. Yep. Got you waiting in a uh, uh, mile long line, standing in front of the store waiting for some for uh, the, the new iPhone 6. Right? It's all right. Yep. 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 Go ahead, let's yeah, I, was gonna, I was just going to say it's pretty much the same thing you said. Same technology is released every year. It might be slightly improved. <laughs> And then they trick you to come in and buy it. And you know, our people, people in general, go crazy by the next phone that come out. That's right. Our people yep. especially go crazy by the new pair of Jordans that come out. That's right. That's and weird. guess what? More and more niggas die every year buying the damn Jordans. Where them shoes are made overseas somewhere for five dollars an hour in a sweatshop. Not even and then they, if that, yeah. and then they're brought here, and then you pay two hundred fifty, three hundred dollars for these shoes. That's right. It don't make no damn sense. Don't make no sense at all. You spending all that money on shoes and cars, but you eating McDonald's. Yeah, 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 yeah. Why not treat yourself to, to things that help your life, like good food, great food? You should be happy when you find out in the grocery store that, man, they got, these are actually uh, good good oranges, good watermelons that you can eat. <laughs> and yes, I said watermelon. <laughs> If they got great food, hey man, this chicken this is actually organic. Yeah. Why should why, you should be happy when you find out stuff like that? Yeah. When the new uh you know new market comes to town, right? Yeah. Like what's the one in our uh, natural grocery? Yeah. You got vitamins, supplements, things that can help you in your life. You Jake should be learning out outside the store when that's coming to town. Yeah. But can I, can I say one thing too? Like you mentioned earlier, the brave new books we just went went to down there. Right. I mean, if this place was all about, if people are all about really finding out knowledge, I'm not saying all the knowledge that they have in there in those books is valid. But if you really want to find something that is realistic, not the BS you see in the media all the time, you figure that place would have a whole lot of business. Right. It's still around, but you figure you have people lining up in bookstores and video stores looking for documentaries. All right, blowing YouTube up, searching. People are all they're looking for. Two, like I said, two chains, future, world star hip hop. All right, all of that BS is pushed on on on, on mainstream media. That's right. That's right. Like I said, the lust of the flesh, the lust. Of, that's that's what the brothers talking about. The pride of life. Mm -hmm. All that is what two thirds of the nation of Israel gobbles up day in and day out. That's right. That's right. None stop. Okay, the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life. And the Lord hates all of that. The Lord's right. telling through the scriptures, He hates all of that. When are, you, when are you gonna stop your madness? Like, when do you get tired? When do you take a break and say, you know what, this is dumb? Why don't I just come back to the law? You know, they're not. They're not. They're they were slated for two thirdism. Right. <laughs> This is 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 6. Therefore, let us not sleep as do others, but let us watch and be sober. For they that sleep, sleep in the night, 
right? And they that be drunken are drunken in the night. Mm. So we we start from the top on that for Karen, right. this is uh first Thessalonians chapter five, verse six. Therefore let us not sleep as do others, mm -hmm. but let us watch and be sober. And that's what we do. Throughout the week, we constantly sending each other articles. We constantly keeping up with on the news. Right. Constantly trying to be in the know, trying to learn a little something new. You know, we trying to watch and be sober. Not sober in the sense of not drinking, but sober in the sense of understanding what's going on around you, and that you could be killed at any at any minute in your life. You could be taken out. Right. That's right. 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 So you so you say in your mind, man, I'm, I'm gonna sit my ass down. They killing niggas for fun in these streets. That's right. It make you not even want to go out and just go take a simple ride to a right. gas station or something. They, like, man, right. you get pulled over. Hey, I just got pulled over a week ago. Mm -hmm. He said, did you realize how fast you were going? I was like, yeah, it was about 45 miles. No, you were going about 58. But then I'm, I'm thinking to myself, okay, you're worried about how fast I'm going, but you just didn't stop the accident that just happened. Right. Right? Right. <laughs> right. Right as I left. Right. You know, I'm like, you're not worried about the motherfucker that's really speeding. I'm like, us, man, he, it's just like, damn, man, these devils just ready to get you for anything. That's right. It's you know what I'm saying? And, and, the, and the only thing you can do, man, is just, no, just kind of like suck it up. They got a, they got a quota to me. They got a certain amount of, of stops they got to make because they trying to fill their pockets. That's right. They not out here to protect and serve. They really what, not. What they that's, the point. that's the point I was making. That, because right. it was like, you went to stop me. I wasn't trying to be no speed demon. I was just trying to get to a certain location. Okay, I may not have been aware of the speed limit I'm going, but I wasn't driving all wild like I'm trying right. to race somebody. But you're not stopping the, the crazy people that's actually out there spinning off on the dang old road just as I left from you giving me the ticket. Yeah. But now it's to the point where you get pulled over by the cops. You just, man, just please don't kill me, man. Yeah. That, right. That's exactly what just I was thinking. I'm like, man, I'm like, man, I'm like, man, I hope this damn cop don't act a dang on fool, man. Right. Because they're going to throw some evidence in the car, and as soon as the crack rocks hit your lap, just, it's over. Yep. Put your hands up, he's going to kill you. But, you know, I, I wasn't in, in fear in the sense of, of like, dang, you know. Because, like, man, the most high, man, the will of the most high is with us, man. You know what I'm saying? Lord, 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 Lord willing. willing. You know what I'm saying? Lord willing. That, that's a water for correcting me on that. And, and it's just like, man, you know, that's why you gotta, that's why you have to pray, man. That's why you have to pay attention to what's really going on around you. Not just some little incident in Ferguson. It's happening out here too. Yep. That's right. Yep. See, they it. getting drugged and beat the hell down out here too. That's yep. right. If I can say, speaking on this um, police uh, 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 incidents, like the, the one with, what's his name, Joe? Uh, uh, the I, the, the so-called, the, the son oh, of yeah. Jamil, something, something, like that. something Powell, Jamil Powell, that was his name. Powell, there you go. Speaking of that, which, when I first saw it, when I first saw it, you know, the, the, the video at first, I was like, okay, you know, he got shot by the cops. I didn't really think nothing of it other than another nigga got shot by the cops. Then video started coming out, more and more details started getting pointed out by the IUIC ends up on our Russia Today, all right? The brother Yakanan did a video going in on the elder right. bar, came and did a, a video on that. It's like, okay, this is a damn setup. But the point I'm making is, Nate, when you read Matthew 5 and 25, it says, if he agree with that adversary quickly while he's out in the way, yeah. lest, he, lest he take to the magistrate and be taken to prison. Well, if that's the case, why wasn't this mother uh, 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 teaching her son the words of Christ? Right. That's, when you read that scripture, that, that'll be in the red letter Bible. You know, they are in the red letters. So if you're Israel united in Christ, why won't you teach them those words of Christ and not to, to, a, to, to not go against the adversary of the police? Why, right? why don't y'all teach him that the Lord said vengeance belongs to him? Yeah. Right. So you walk right. around with a knife, you going off. Yep. Right. Where was y'all teaching then? And another thing, I don't mean to cut you off, another thing is, if y'all so upset about the man getting chopped down by the police, why don't y'all quit the force? And yeah, show the yeah, people yeah. How, how much you're upset. Right. Yeah, right. That's right. Or are you going to come out and say, he was a rebel. He was a rebel. Yeah. Hey, what you going to do? He was, he was rebellion. He was rebellion. That's rebellion. What you going to say? What are you going to do?
do. Huh. Yeah, yeah, if we're not there yelling that out. If, if you're really about the spirit of, uh, um, of if you, how you say most high in Christ, or how we say you about Shimmy all shot, if you're really down with that, why don't you quit the force? Like I said, we did a video last week. And all, it's been it's been a topic, an ongoing topic since. But why don't you take that opportunity to curse this man out to his face? Right. Be in front of the whole world. Cuss, right. to let this man know his downfall, why he's wicked, his wicked deeds, and the fate of this country. And do a video where y'all all rip your, your cop badge off your shirt and throw it on the ground hard as hell. A bunch of damn cowards. And say, we're not going to take this no more. Yeah. Won't y'all do something like that? But no, you're not going to do that. Y'all going to continue gonna to be cops. Y'all continue Cow. to go hey, to man, be no pictures, on the man. side of the oppressor. He too far to go at it. That's our first one. Oh, yeah. The yeah. first one. Sorry, he man. gave us the finger. Why don't y'all make a move? Why don't y'all do something? Show how mad you are at this king. Yeah, you're gonna get up there and read from a script about your son getting, nah, that's, that's all smoke and mirrors. If, if I had a son or any family member, or uh, first and foremost, any of these brothers, if something like that happened to them, I'm not gonna be reading from no script. Face full of makeup, clothes pressed. Come on, Shirts really? looking good. Wait a minute. Oh, if I can say that. In the scriptures, when somebody was mourning for a family or a great man in Israel, it says they put a, a, a sackcloth on and put dust upon their heads. I mean, they weren't concerned with, uh, with the way they look. These people, IUIC, were well presented for the whole world to see. They made sure to zoom in on that IUIC logo. She had like, that demonic headdress on all over her head wrap. Right. But you don't believe in it. But you know what? That's how you would expect a church that's under the 501c3 to act. That's right. Because right. they went to Egypt for help. They didn't go to the Most High. They didn't go to your Howabah, Shemiah, Shah. They won't even say the name. Right. They'll say, yo, play yo. Yeah. But then if I call you Cracker Jack, you'll be mad. Right. Yeah. Talking about, no, nah, nah, my name ain't that. My name is such and such. I have done this, that, and the other. Yeah. Now, your, your name is Joe Play Yoga. Right. Right? right? I got something. Go ahead. This is Isaiah 30, verse 1. Woe to the rebellious children, said the Lord. If that you're not saying the name of the Lord, that's rebellion, rebellion. Yeah, that's you rebellion. being rebellious. Yep. <laughs> yep. You being rebellious. And it's right. not to me. It's not to, to, to the apostles of GMS, to the other brothers out there preaching of GMS. You being rebellious to the Most High and His Son. Yep. Woe to the rebellious children, saith the Lord, that take counsel, but not of me, and they cover with their covering, but not of my spirit, that they may add sin to sin. That they may add sin to sin. And they have a covering, but it's not of the Lord. It's not of Yahweh Bashim Yahushua. It's of Jesus Christ and, and God. That's who your covering is. And we don't have the sign today, but I'll show you who Jesus Christ is. Even he knows Jesus Christ is Lucifer. This is Lucifer himself right here. Right. <laughs> Even he right. knows who Let's Jesus see, Christ is. That now you're see, the so-called white man, when you call him Lucifer, he ain't gonna get mad. He ain't gonna get nah. upset. Ain't gonna do Look, what you yeah, got a smile on this, man. What the fuck you talking about, man? You hear what I'm talking about. No, I've been hearing something about I'm it. talking about this Bible. Hey, you got now, you being man. upset, that ain't you. You can get mad and dude. do whatever you want to do. I'm not mad, dude. Right? That's cool. I'm glad you're not mad. Back up, man. What happened? Back up, man. Back up. That's, yeah, that's, yeah, I said the same thing, but, you know, when it, when it all goes down, you'll be ready to go. It's still good. Uh, it's still recording, at least. Division is coming. 
Yeah, it's just, no, don't worry about it. Yeah, I'll call for it. Go, I got it, I got it. You're safer than knocking me out. I'm telling you, man, if you go, if you if you touch one of us, it's good, you're going in the back. Get away from me. I'm not touching you. Get away from me, man. Step away. You good. You got options, man. Look, look, listen to me. Listen to me. Why don't y'all go find something to do? Ain't nobody trying to fight you. Just go find something to do. Just go find something to do. Then you talk about knocking me out. Why don't you do that, man? Go away. It worked. It worked a minute ago. I'll give you that. I fucked up. I pushed you. I fucked up. But I'll tell you this. Why don't you just go on and go? I'm not even talking to you. Okay, but if you stay here, yeah, then you're going to be susceptible yeah, to what I plan on doing. Yeah, so it's up to you. I'm going to call the cops. I'm going to call the cops. Hey, somebody call the cops. Get out the way. Somebody call the cops. Hey, you got a phone? Is the camera on? Yes, it's on. Is it recording? Yep. Okay. Just get out the way, man. What was you holding? Uh, Isaiah 30. Second is a 15 and Isaiah 30. Look, you see that camera? You see the camera? I'm not worried about you. I'm talking to you. Hey, hey, hey. Chill, chill, chill. The boys look worried as hell. Chill, chill, chill. Boys are mad. Chill, man. You know I'm not being dangerous. Get back. Man, go away. Stop. Stop, man. Stop. Just go. Go. Get from the camera, man. Go find something to do. Oh, man, keep Look, man. Distance, go man. Man. Go 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 Man, go away. Go away, man. Go away. Oh, my goodness. I'm about to chuck you in that trash can. Go away, man. You're going to chuck me in that trash can? Yeah, that's what I said. I'm going to chuck you in the trash can. Chill, chill, chill. Nah. Go ahead with that priest, bro. No, come on, Leave me alone. Go ahead with that, yeah. Leave me alone. You know what? Find the part where it talks about Jesus. Go to Revelation. Go to Revelation 1. Let's talk about who the world calls Jesus. Let's talk about it. Man, get away from me, man. That's all right. Get away. Satan is swarming around like the Lord of the Flies. I'm telling you to get away from me. Go ahead. Revelation chapter 1, verse 12. Well, you want to talk about Jesus, so-called Jesus, we're going to tell y'all about Jesus. Don't now, that word, what does that word revelation mean? Get away from me. Away from you know, I'm not touching you. If you do that again, I'm going to hit you. I'm not touching you. Get the fuck away from me, man. Why are you touching me? Get the, get away. No, look, no, hold up, man. Get away, man. Get away. Walk off. Walk off. Walk off, bro. And I turned to see the voice that spake with me. And being turned, I said, I'm stepping going Take it off the hell off. I toss one. Take it off. Take off, man. Walk off. Get out of here. Get out of here. Revelation chapter 1, verse 12. That drunk ass is on, man. Jesus Christ. Who is Jesus Christ? Since the name was brought up, who is he? Who is he? Jesus Christ is the one that got these two out here like this. Drunk, looking crazy, destitute. Look at you. Right? If we was if we was white men in suits, y'all wouldn't be doing this shit. Y'all would have all kinds of respect. And you know it. Y'all come out here smelling like feet and french fries and shit, man. You know what I mean? But I don't, it don't matter. I don't smell like you. I don't smell like you. Come here, all right. Come here, all right. Come here, all right. Come here, all right. Because y'all ain't going to push us out of our spot. You ain't going to, no. So if you, yeah, we're here. Y'all came to us. I've been here since 1979. Tell them walk off. You tough Go away, man. We don't even bother any y'all. Walk away. You want to buy me, so I'll try to walk to you. Walk away. Who walked that way? Walk to me, y'all on Plus, you made contact with us. No, I'm not that with you. Yes, you he did. did. It's Revelation chapter 1, no, verse 12. And I turned to see the voice that spake with me. That's right. And being turned, I saw seven golden candlesticks. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, clothed with a garment down to the foot. Now that's talking about the true image of who you call Jesus Christ. That's what he's talking about. The true image of who you call Jesus Christ. That's good. That's who it's talking about. It's not talking about that long, long hair. That's not what he's talking about. That's not what he's talking about. Hey, 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 hey. Come on, man. Hey, 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 hey. 
Hey, hey, get him, get him, get, get him, Mark. Get him, Mark. Go ahead. Go ahead. Sweet. Yep. Don't bother him, man. I ain't bothering you. All right, keep reading. And it says, and in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one likened to the Son of Man, clothed with a gold.